Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Sagittarius, February 5, 2022. Expect to receive word from people you haven't heard from in some time. Today's mail could be full to the brim with cards and letters. Why not make yourself a cup of tea and savor each and every correspondence? You could wind up feeling nostalgic for the good old days when life seemed simpler and more of your friends were nearby. Pick up the phone and give one of those old friends a call, she'd be delighted to hear from you. Sometimes you can be very set in the way you look at something. You tend to form an opinion quickly, and once you've made up your mind, nothing can convince you otherwise. Today you might want to reconsider a judgment that you have made. More information and insight could be coming to light. Perhaps this involves a loved one. You might have greater understanding about their motivations and feelings. This can help you to declare a truce today. Today, you'll probably find that you have a ton of energy at your disposal for getting into all kinds of activities. Finish any work that still needs to be completed, consider doing some cleaning and organizing, or see about getting out for a little outdoor fun. Whatever you choose, try to make sure it's active. You'll need a place for all that energy to go, and quiet sit-down activities will not cut it for you. Heightened imagination and ingenuity could bring new thoughts for advancing yourself in the financial arena. Practical information from outside sources, such as newspapers or magazines, merges with insights from within to bring useful ideas your way. Consider everything carefully before taking any action, and be open to the advice and counsel of others. In whatever you choose to do, however, Today shows promise of being very successful and fortunate. Relations with friends and family are very positive. The atmosphere is full of openness and a zest for life. It's time to share your good mood with as many people as possible. Use the leisure facilities in your neighborhood and meet up with friends. Having fun together bonds your friendships even closer. Before you hit the town tonight, spend some companionable, even gushy time with a friend who shares your passions. Things are starting to look good for you in group social settings and just in time for the weekend. You feel content and use any opportunity to get some useful feedback from a partner regarding exactly how they feel about you. Whether you want to enter a long-term relationship or you appreciate life as it is, make a decision about the type of person you want to be with and decide how you feel about them. If you have been considering some plans which require the cooperation of a group, this is the right time to set things in motion. Now you are powerful enough to take on this sort of project. For quite a while now, you have been aware of a surge of energy inside which demands an outlet. Today brings a great opportunity to express it. This will definitely be an important day in terms of your relationships. Others will have a lot of influence over you today and you will be dependent on someone or a situation. But don't let this frighten you, because you can take advantage of this to advance your projects with other people, to collaborate with your partners more closely and exchange points of view and ideas. This hold on you by others is in no way detrimental to your personal happiness, so don't worry. You could be surprised at how well people around you are getting along today. After some recent arguments or differences of opinion, peace should now prevail. Your friends may have put an end to their fighting and declared a truce. Meanwhile, things could be more harmonious within your family. Your kids may have grown tired of their games of tug of war. Enjoy the quiet and harmony of the day. In isolation, Mercury's direct turn in your busy work sector today would have released the brakes slowing things down and whether at work or with whatever it is that keeps you busy, things would slowly move forward and the pace would gradually pick up. Instead, Mars return last week means that the planet of passion and the warrior planet of the cosmos has been impatiently putting his foot on the gas and with the brakes released, things are set to accelerate forward at pace. As the last planet in the solar system in retrograde motion, this is likely to be felt across all aspects of your life. Just nine days after Mercury, the planet of communication retrograde back out of your relationship sector, his direct turn today will see him begin the 11-day trek back. 
This comes just as the Sun and Saturn aligned to capitalize on a new moon here two days ago and a growing resolve to do whatever it takes for as long as it takes. The Cancer Sun shares a tender aspect with Neptune in Pisces today. This can make you extremely dreamy and open to turning your visions into reality. It's a time to welcome artistic sentiments and embrace any subconscious notions. A desire to create could be strong, but you have to be careful that you're aligning with the right project that speaks to you on a spiritual and soulful level. Neptune's gentle vibes could also make you feel extremely tired. You might want to take a few naps during the day or go to bed early. The flip side of this transit is that it can make us more susceptible to deception and illusion. You could be the victim of gaslighting or people taking you for granted, and this could result in drama or lies being exposed. Prepare yourself for an emotional showdown that could rock your world. Paranoia may be high, and you might think that others are trying to intentionally sabotage your projects and relationships. Odds are that this isn't the case, but you could be thinking it in the back of your mind. It's not that you really believe this is going on, but people could be acting out of character, triggering you to think things are actually happening. In the pre-dawn hours, the Cancer Sun trines Neptune in Pisces. This twice-yearly aspect inspires idealism and provides a powerful transmission of divine love. We see beauty all around us and act from a place of gratitude. This is an excellent transit for doing any creative, spiritual, meditative, or philanthropic work. Faith can be used for the purposes of manifestation, but also proves healing, insulating us from negativity. We might feel somewhat out of time now, or perhaps time seems irrelevant, as we are so involved in our mission that we don't notice the hours ticking away. Naturally, we can fall prey to delusional thinking in this Neptunian territory, but the repercussions of these thoughts will not be detrimental, largely because we are seeking to demonstrate our ethics, not to force them upon others. In the morning, the moon enters Libra. Saturn is currently the only other planet in an air sign, and so the moon assists in bringing more mental energy into the mix, helping us to be fair and objective. This is not to imply that decision-making will necessarily come easy, given the Libra moon's penchant for indecision and vacillation. Harmony is our intention, and over the next two days, we will be more interested in the health and well-being of our relationships, believing them to be symbolic representations of our interior emotional balance. Just be mindful that you are not betraying yourself in order to keep the peace.